Hebrews 11.1 1 says, Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Faith, think of that, it is evidence. Faith is an evidence of an unseen world. Faith is the evidence of an unseen world. So much for those who say, well, if I see it, I'll believe it. Seeing is not believing. Seeing is not believing. Seeing is knowing. Believing is a far greater, far more dynamic realm than knowing. Believing causes you to be able to know something. Seeing it in the spirit, seeing it in the natural, two different things. Seeing it in the spirit is in the realm of where faith works. Faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Faith makes invisible realities a visible reality. Listen, but it says something else about faith. That it's the, thing, the substance of things hoped for, which means no one ever hopes for something that's already passed. Hoping that your favorite football team wins last year's uh, Super Bowl, that's not going to work, unless in reality they did. But hoping for it to happen doesn't make it happen. Hoping, you're only going to be hoping for next year's Super Bowl, right? So faith is a substance of what is coming. Faith is not the substance of what was, it's the substance of what is coming. To say, I believe in the miracles of the Bible, but I don't believe they happen now, it, those things cannot be said together and be in real Bible faith. To say you believe in the miracles of the Bible means you believe them now, and you're hoping for them for the future. Glory be to God. Faith is a substance of things hoped for. It's a future reality. <clears throat> Religious people speak in such, such, such uh, uh, terms that no wonder the world thinks we're crazy. It's like hoping for, the, hoping for the past when anyone knows that hope is about your future. I hope it works out, they say. I hope the man doesn't die. I hope, I hope, I hope. But that's like watching the 6 o'clock news after you've already seen it in the morning and you saw the guy jump from the building hoping that he doesn't. It's already happened. It's too late at 6 o'clock to hope he... Got it? Yeah. Faith is a substance of things you're hoping for. What are you hoping for today? What are you hoping for today? Your faith is what will cause that invisible hope to become a tangible, visible reality. There's a lot of discussion about what faith is. None of that discussion is necessary. The Bible defines it very clearly. There's just one way really to get it all working, though, and that is by what you say about it. If you'll just say what God has said, for instance, if you've got a problem in your body, in your physical body, why not just say what the Word of God says about it? As a believer in Jesus, you have a right to say, I believe by His stripes I am healed. That might not be a tangible reality at the moment, but your faith, saying it with your mouth, that faith kicks in, glory be to God, which will cause that invisible hope to become a tangible right now reality. Not only have I heard about this, I've experienced this myself many, many times, that the moment I began to say what God said about me, things started changing. I'm Pastor John. I hope you have a great day.